students, Mrs. Xiao Xiao, and today I'm going to teach my student about scientific notation. So it's pretty important to learn about scientific notation. So let's get started and see how do they do. Okay, hi students, say hi to YouTube. Hello YouTube. Very good. So let me introduce our student first. Uh, so this is one of my favorite student. She is Bear Bear. She's also one of my famous students. Hi, I'm Bryce. YouTube, how how are you guys doing? Huh? Hi, I'm Laurel. Okay, I'm. Hey, if if you're if you watch my channel, you will know that I'm Laurel, and I publish videos and stuff. Okay, get over here. Oh, sorry. Hi, I'm Greedy, and I'm really rich, and you guys all know that, huh? Hi, I'm Shelly, and I'm a cat. Huh? <laughs> YouTubers, I'm so sorry about reindeer's appearance. So I apologize for that. But anyways, we're going to move on to learning. You little deer, what was your purpose? Your purpose was to learn, right? No, dance the deer, deer dance. Be quiet. <laughs> okay. So let's stop listening to those uh, languages or these gorgeous speeches. So yeah. So anyways, um, and now I'm teaching people scientific notation. Okay, so scientific notation is a way to write a number. It's pretty obvious that you might think, oh, five is five over over one. Is that scientific notation? Nah, not really. So. What I meant for one way to write a number is that when if I gave you a times ten to the nth power, that's a formula of the scientific notation. So let's see, a must be greater or equal to one, but it must be less than ten. That's a scientific notation. And n n must be an integer. So let's see an example. If I gave you five point six three times ten to the fifth power, so what are we going to get? So that was one way of writing the scientific notation. Um, the second example was, ouch! Who pushed me? Who pushed me? Must be punished. Is that you, little dear, dear Millie Buckley? Sorry, I am just a, a little small reindeer. Shut up! Jeez, oh, why does she never shut up? Oh, that was kind of exhausted. I knew YouTube. I'm sorry. Okay, enough, Laurel. Sorry, Mrs. Chong Chong. Okay, so that's the rule of our lesson. And today we just learn about what is scientific notation. It is one way to write a number. And a times ten to the nth power, a must be greater than or equal to one, and it must be less than ten, like two point zero zero five times ten to the negative seventh power. That is a scientific notation. Bye, guys. Bye.